vibe yetu vibe kama lote Yes sir. Area code ya mwisho na ya tatu inatupeleka mpaka EMB. EMB EMB kwa bahati. Hapa tuseme EMB kwa sababu Diana ndo sikuiza kwa signed bana pale si ndio. Bahati amekuwa akiongea wiki hii. Mnakumbuka the last election ambayo tumekuwa nayo kama taifa. Bahati ni moja kati ya vijana ambao walijitokeza vizuri. Akasema ako na vision kwa madhari pale. Anataka awe MP, achaguliwe asimamie vijana the end of the day. Sasa wiki hii bahati alikuwa anaongea na akasema alitumia milioni 27 za Kenya kufanya campaign eh, 27 million i don't know if you guys believe this story but anasema alitumia 27 million ku campaign but he didn't uh, win and then kulikuwa na story mobs as just certificate whatever kanza kulia it was a long story but issue yangu iko hapo kwa mafigures hapa 27 million kufanya campaign kwani 27 million 27 million kwa kwa ni pesa ngapi sababu kama ni hii ambayo unajua 27 Kenya shillings That's crazy. Unajua you know, ukikonvert to Tanzanian shillings hizi ni mabilioni ma, ma huko. <laughs> Bahati hapa anatupima ama hapa inabidi figures zitajwe tu alafu vitu ndo vi make sense. Na alikuwa na of course nimesikia bite zake na nini hapo. Jamaa analielea sana. Sema yeye yeah, hakuona na venye litritiwa kabisa na Jubilee kama ilikuwa fair in any way. Na apendelei. No baadaye kabisa bana saa hizi. Tuliona ali, ali switch cam saa hizi akona UDA ako Kenya kwanza na dubi to flan. Hii 27 million wakati unaitumia kwenye campaign na wewe ni kijana kama bahati na unakosa kushinda. Tuseme sababu yeye ndo ametumia ametumia 27 million yeye ndo alitumia pesa sio sisi. So hii information ambayo uko nayo hakuna venye unaweza i fact check by the way. You can't. Hii sio story ya ku fact check hata kidogo. Unajaribu ku ma fact whatever you you can't. Yeye yeah, amesema you don't have his bank statement. Na una breakdown uh, they don't uh, post this vitu. I mean nimelipwa gari ya campaign hivi ma t-shirt, chakula whatever they don't share all this information. They just tell you like I used like 5 million I used 27 million Kenya shillings ku campaign. Una muamini bahati akisema alitumia shilingi za Kenya 27 million ku campaign. Do you do you believe that statement? Paka hapo tu like I, I want to go into details sana venye alichezwa na ma certificate da nini mpaka na step down mpaka is no longer there mpaka na switch code na kuja kwa Kenya kwanza saa hizi. Do you believe the guy 27 million kufanya campaign. Alikuwa na vision ya madhari pale. Akaanza kujita mtoto wa madhari. Naamini alikuwa na very good chance ya kushinda because he's a very popular musician definitely. Lakini kwa angle ya kutumia 27 million. Hapo ndo unaona kama kuna karata fulani hivi tunatolewa karata ya karata ya tatu ni sema ya tatu. Alafu ya tatu inakuanga ina hatari. Unaanga detail sana wakati unatupiwa karata ya tatu inabidi ukae hivyo kula chuma wewe utulie. 27 million. I don't think kama ni ukweli you know. Even though we cannot fact check the information about Napata from Bahati ya kutumia 27 million ya ku campaign I don't think so man I don't think so Sababu come to think of it yani Madari is Madari is a very good place na Madari kuna watu wengi sana na Bahati anajulikana sana wakati unatumia pesa mob sana kwa campaign ina maana kwamba hauko kwa ground kiivyo Bahati anajulikana from the music from the shows from charity na kila kitu so he is well known huko Madari so budget yake maybe ingekuwa chini kidogo sababu yeye already ni mtu ambaye uko mtaani E27 million inaniweka kwenye angle ya ku switch story kidogo because immediately after whatever happened happened which atuna information pia kwa nini alikuwa short change and all mpaka ayuko tena kwenye jubilee na uh, team ya Raila na Kenya whatever immediately aka switch akakuja kwa Kenya kwanza hapo sasa kama alitumia 27 million akapoteza mtu anaweza sema maybe wakati ana switch loyalty na kuja kwa Kenya, kwa Kenya kwanza hapa kuna kitu kinu, <laughs> kuna kitu ya membership pale kuna kitu pale inabidi kuna check pale inabidi itembee sababu uje ni biashara it's a biz, political business <laughs> he used I'm, i'm just saying maybe 27 million aka 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 akapigwa moja kubwa so inabidi change side ndio arudi side nyingine kuna ile ambao walimkaribisha nayo ama sasa ilikwaje <laughs> Na jambo bahati na yeye na anapenda kutengeneza ma story sana ni mtu wa cloud sana 27 million i don't think so but just because ali switch akakuja kwa Kenya kwanza basi nataka kuamini kwamba jamaa wa kiukweli alitumia pesa lakini haikufikia 27 million you know what i'm saying na kukuja hii side nyingine immediately pia maybe kuna kitu alikuwa pale na KRG sema mambo sasa ni yellow na Ruto atatawala miaka sijii ngapi za ku you know i don't know man it's crazy 
27 million doesn't make sense doesn't make any sense unafikiri bahati atoe mziki you know turudi kwa kutoa mziki turudi kwa kutoa albums turudi kwa kutoa ep is one of the best by the way wasanii ambao wanafanya love songs plus 254 size but anafanya vizuri sana so stories za mpaka wa leo mpaka hii wiki bado una comment kuhusu election ya last time when you lutumia mado no 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 we what what walikujua kama msanii vijana ambao wanaelewa burudani walikujua kama msanii rudi studio Last time uliona Bahati akifanya show ilikuwa lini by the way. When was the last time Bahati alisema anakuja show anafanya show? No, he doesn't do shows anymore. He doesn't do shows kabisa ni squeeze. Siati aziko ama hezi panga ama hezi panga ta concept even zake. Wakati alikuwa anafanya gospel tulikuwa tunajua every year Bahati anaenda kujaza Thika Stadium. Alikuwa na yani drive plan hivi ya muziki. Alikuwa na do muziki na mashows. Squeeze is so much sana. Amejilvol na vitu vingi sana mpaka amesahau kwamba the first thing ambayo alikuwa anadu, yeye yeah, alikuwa msanii. So usiwahi sahau. Hata sasa ukiingia kwenye siasa uko na wanasiasa around you na unaamini kabisa kwamba size unasema mimi mi, na defect hii side na ile side wa kuite mkai chini sababu uko na numbers mtaani. Uko na hizo numbers sababu wewe ni ulikuwa msanii the first time. Hiyo usani wako ndio imefanywa kuna numbers mtaani. So usiwahi sahau your first thing. Don't forget the why, you know. People do forget the why so much. Don't forget why uko na hizo vitu zote zenye uko nazo size because you're a fast musician. So the only message ambayo tuko nayo kama vijana ambao wanamkubali sana mtoto wa mama from day one, uno siku za mama na nini mpaka wa leo. We don't care kama aliacha gospel anafanya secular. Hapana, muziki unaongea na anatoa ma classics mango makali kali. Nani afurahi akisikiza wa nani? We all vibing to it. It's a big joint. Mtaachana tu is is a good guy anaimba vizuri lyrics na make sense Rudy Studio wachana siasa ku complain whatever Rudy Studio fanya ngoma panga event zako venye ulikuwa unapanga wakati ulikuwa unafanya gospel wacha watu wakujue na the first thing ambao walikujua na all these things ambazo zinakuja baada ya ile kitu ya kwanza ni extra true ambazo zimekuja kama blessings It's because of what we knew you for kenye tulianza kukusupport nayo day one una check nafikiri message sio kwa bahati tu kwa kila mtu ambaye uko mtaani ukiwa blessed mom mpaka una uko na vitu vingi usisahau kama kuna siku ulikuwa na baisikeli sasa hizo kuna gari fulani hivi imetulia so yeah usipitie mtu wa baisikeli alafu na tupia maji kidogo sababu kuna ile nino it doesn't make sense area code ya 3 na ya mwisho kwenye vibe yetu this new saturday vibe yetu area code everybody know when i come around I go by the name Tefera aka unajua kijana wa 46 langa langa unasikiza show kubwa Minetro Kali Bukoyo kila siku ya Jumamosi kuanzia saa 4 asubuhi mpaka saa 8 nisikilize live kwenye 89.2 radio yetu kwenye show ya vibe yetu top 20 Kali za Nax Vegas ma stories za burudani na exclusive interviews vibe yetu vibe kama lote Dream on a nasca fit nasca for me nasca you gonna buy